Hey there, so today I'm going to take you through a very quick video on how to set up G reminders for uh, to get a voice reminder or a, a call uh, before a meeting you have scheduled or some other thing. So it's set it up so it's all automatic and uh, just before the call you'll get a reminder or you can set it up for your client to get a reminder so they get a voice call uh, to let them know that uh, the call's coming up. So this could be useful for people that prefer that over SMS uh, notification or who aren't checking their emails as much. So, uh, and it, it's a bit different than another kind of uh, notification as well. So let's jump in. So I've got this in Google Calendar. I've, got, I've already got this invitation set up. I've sent it to my client, Mary. It's already uh, set up with Zoom. And uh, I've, I've got this in some other videos uh, to show you how to do that. And also I've shown in some other videos how to set up G reminders. So check those out if you haven't seen those yet. So we're gonna assume knowledge and proceed. The uh, basically with this in mind, we can go to G reminders. So it's greminders.com. And I'm using the trial, uh, which lasts for seven days, but uh, you'll, need to, you'll need to have a paid account after those, the trial is up in order to use this feature. Basically, Here's the, here's the meeting that's coming up. It shows all my upcoming meetings. And what I need to do is go to settings and then go to templates. And then here we can add a template, which is basically like a little mini automation, which allows us to select, uh, allows the system to know who to send to in what situation. So we're creating a new template. We're gonna say it's a reminder. We're gonna select any event title that contains the text consulting call. I've already typed this before, so I can just click that. Then we're gonna send a phone call five minutes prior to the appointment time. And the phone message is gonna say this. I'm gonna keep it all as default, but you can, you can change and insert different variables if you want to. And we're gonna keep it all like this for now and then click save. And then I might do the same with the SMS. I'm gonna edit this SMS one, which I set up previously. I'm gonna make that five minutes as well. So we'll get both those messages come in. This one has a Zoom link reminder, which is just here. You can see, you can add in Zoom join link or some of the other ones as well. So I'll save that and that's it. So let's go back to the templates and we can see we've got an email set up for 24 hours before an SMS for five minutes before and a voice call for five minutes before. Any time that an event title includes the name consulting call in the title, the text. And the phone number is pulled from the email content as well automatically. So you need to make sure that that's in the, the meeting description or in the meeting title as well. The phone number of your client or customer uh, or whoever you want to get the notification when, when that happens. I, I think in reality, you'd probably only want one of these uh, for my clients, SMS is preferred, but for you, perhaps voice works out. Okay, I hope this is useful. Let me know in the comments if there's any other things you want to learn about this uh, platform. And uh, next, the next uh, session, I'll probably go through how to set up this for meeting scheduling as well. So it can do, can do all these things together. Okay, great. Thanks very much. Cheers.